Good morning friends. First of all, let us look at the global queues for today. So yesterday, the Dow Jones Industrial Average was down by 112 points. The Nasdaq closed 66 points up. And as of now, SGX Nifty is trading 20 points down. The Brent crude oil is down by $0.36 and the gold MCX is up by 0.11%. We can expect a flat opening in the Nifty today at 9.15 am. The stocks in news for today. The first stock is Tata Motors. The company has come up with the Q3 update. The Q3 JLR sales that is Jaguar Land Rover that is uh, uh, foreign subsidiary figures has increased 5.7 percent quarter on quarter at 79,591 units. Order book is at a record high of 2.15 lakh units. So these are all positives for the company and we can expect an up move in the stock. The second stock is Lupin. It's a pharmaceutical company. It has got approval from Spanish government for Mexitline, one of its drugs. The drug is used for symptomatic treatment of myotonia in adults with non dystrophic myotonic disorders. It is a type of inherited neuromuscular disorder. So this is a positive news for lupin and we can expect an up move in lupin. The third stock is IRB Infra. In Q3, overall toll collections in December was up by 6% at rupees 388 crores. On year on year basis, toll collection in December increased 31%. So these are all positives for the company and we can expect an up move in IRB Infra a infrastructure development company. The first stock is Sona BLW. The Sona BLW is to acquire 54% stake and voting rights in Serbia based Novelic for cash consideration of 40.5 million euros payable in three stretches in two years. Novelic has been profitable ever since its inception and its addition to the company will going to increase the revenues of the company and also the profitability of the company. So this is a good news for the company and we can expect an up move in Sona BLW. The last talk is Reliance. Reliance Geo launches Geo 5G services in 10 more cities. Agra, Kanpur, Meerut, Prayagraj, Tirupati, Nellur, Kozikod, Trishur, Nagpur and Ahmednagar. So this is a positive news for Reliance and we can expect an up move in Reliance as well. Thank you.